Hello, my name is Mark Lieb, winner of the 2016 24 Hour Le Mans race. I'm taking you now for one lap at the famous 24 Hour circuit at Le Mans, uh, just to show you what we're doing behind the steering wheel. We're just about to start the first lap, so we are entering the start finish straight, passing some cars, which is quite normal for this type of racing. You know, we have multiple class racing, passing always slower cars during a 24 hour race. It's very difficult with managing the traffic, one of the most critical parts for a driver. And now we are just going through the Dunlop Bridge into the S's. Very fast corner, very fast section of the circuit. Also quite difficult because you have a lot of tarmac changes on the ground. Now entering Tetri Rouge, really fast corner in fifth gear. And now we have the first time a long straight line. It's called the Hunodia straight. And this is one really fast section where we reach the first time over 300 kilometers per hour. We reach 335 kilometers per hour just before the braking zone. Heavy braking now, entering right hand in fourth gear, left hand in third gear. Now accelerating again with all the power of the 919 hybrid. So in total we have about 900 horsepower on the acceleration, 500 from the combustion engine, and over 400 from the electric motor on the front wheel, on the front axle. Driving on these straight lines gives us the opportunity to communicate with the pits. It's very different to other racetracks where we don't have these longer straight lines. This is also one of the reasons why we can stay quite long in the car, so one stint in the night probably will be between three and a half and four hours. So this is quite demanding still, but with these long straights we actually can relax a little bit, can have a drink, and then we can communicate to the pits. Now we are in Mulsan, one of the slow parts, right hand corner, second gear, full acceleration again, pulling the gears with the right hand, with the fingers you can see the right hand on the steering wheel. And now we are in seventh gear again, way over 300. And now we are coming to the Indianapolis corner, very fast right hand corner just without uh, braking, just a little coast, and then a hard, heavy braking zone down to third gear. Another short acceleration for the right-hand corner called Arnage, very slippery, especially in the wet, in the rain, quite tricky to brake. You see sometimes very often cars going straight there. And now we are approaching probably the most fun part of this racetrack. It's called the Porsche Corners. Actually, a very, very fast section of uh, right hand and left hand corners. It's very demanding. You're entering with 250 kilometers per hour, just one downshift from seventh to sixth gear. And then you come to the last left hand corner karting. We have a lot of G forces here, way over three Gs um, lateral acceleration. And now the last two chicanes. The four chicanes quite quick in fourth gear and then the last chicken onto the start finish straight in third gear. So this was one fast lap of the famous circuit at Le Mans. At the 24 race we're doing approximately 375 of these laps. I hope you really enjoyed the ride and keep the fingers crossed for the Porsche team.